The Vatican inaugurated its this year's nativity scene and lighting of the Christmas tree. Take a look. Today's ceremony was presided by the Archbishop uh, Fernando Alzaga. The nativity scene celebrates 200 years of independence from Brit or from Peru, that is, and symbolizes the universal call to salvation. And joining us now from Rome is Andres Tonhauser, EWTN Vatican Bureau Chief. Andres, thank you very much for joining us and tell us more about this year's Christmas tree. Eric, thank you for having me. Over the last few days, workers here have been busy in St. Peter's Square with erecting this year's Christmas tree and a colorful nativity scene from Peru. It was Pope John Paul II in 1982 who started the tradition of the Christmas tree in St. Peter's Square. And this year, we can admire a 28-meter, that's more than 90 feet high, red fir tree. It comes from the Dolomite Mountains on the Italian border with Austria. And Eric, I don't know if you knew that, but I am from Austria as well. It's my home country. And so every day I pass by this beautiful tree, it reminds me a little bit of home. Most definitely. And there's also the nativity scene next to the tree, as you mentioned, and it does come from Peru. Tell us a little bit more about that. So, yes, the nativity scene is from Latin America, specifically Peru, as you said. Uh, it is celebrating its 200 years of independence this year. And there are 30 life-sized figures made of ceramic, maguey wood, and fiberglass. And the figures are wearing traditional costumes from the Chopha, a native community living 12,000 feet high in the Andes Mountains. And pilgrims will be able to see the scene until the 9th of January, which marks the baptism of our Lord. And Andres, we understand that Pope Francis met with the delegation who actually donated that nativity scene? Yes, Eric. Members of this community met Pope Francis today. He told him that he hopes we manage to experience the true spirit of Christmas this year. He said, and I quote, let us not allow to be polluted by consumerism and indifference. We should rather be enveloped by God's closeness, by the Christmas atmosphere that art, music, songs, and traditions bring to our hearts. For that, Eric, I must say the nativity scene and the tree in St. Peter's Square are a good start. Andre Stonehauser, thank you so much for joining us. EWTN Vatican Bureau Chief, thank you very much. Thank you.